Hi, I'm Beth Long. I am founder and CEO of New Day Ranch. Uh, I've been PATH certified for 12 years. PATH is Professional Association of Therapeutic Horsemanship. And then because I love the mental health and educational opportunities with horses, I went on and got a specialty certification called Equine Specialist in Mental Health and Learning. And I've had 20 years of faculty instructor for the YMCA of the USA. We joined the Meadowview Farm in uh, just at the beginning of 2017. New Day Ranch had been operating since 2010. So the farm is 165 acres. We have seven paddocks currently. We have the, the 65 front acres, which is what we consider the working part of the farm. Then there's another additional 100 acres in the back that we are we use for all of our hay to support the horses. There's the, the main house, which Beth is operating and using uh, for her office. There's four buildings. One is the main arena, the main stable, um, the tobacco barn, and we absolutely have room for more boarders. Hi, I'm Jean Dieters and I'm a clinical psychologist in Northern Kentucky. I've been working with New Day for about two years. When I'm at New Day, I do equine facilitated psychotherapy. Equine facilitated psychotherapy is nothing mysterious. In the same way that an art therapist would use drawing or color, to help a person complete a picture of an experience they had, or a music therapist would use music to awaken emotions that someone has already silenced. Equine facilitated psychotherapy uses the relationship with a horse to reconnect. Equine facilitated psychotherapy is all about connection. Many of my patients have been through such negative experiences in their human to human connections that coming out to the farm actually allows them to start shedding some of the natural defenses that they've grown in a result to protect themselves so that they can start a reconnection with another living thing. It is remarkable the changes that we're seeing here at New Day. Patients come depressed, despair, hopeless, and they leave feeling as if there's a new hope or a new day. That's why the name New Day is so important to me. For JT, therapy at New Day has been very helpful because he can interact. He can actually be physically involved in the process. Sitting and talking about it was helpful, but this is actually helping him act out the things that he's been discussing with Dr. Jean. I absolutely, I would recommend this therapy to other kids. Uh, my entire career has been in education and different types of kids could respond in so many different ways to the therapies here. I've seen a lot of changes in JT since he has started working with uh, the New Day Equine Program, Equine Achievement Program. JT has become a lot more confident. Uh, when we started, he had no background at all with horses of any kind. He, I don't even know if he had ever even pet a horse. And so he was intrigued because he likes animals, but nervous, they're, they're huge. And he came into this a blank slate, uh, not very confident, honestly, if, if it was gonna work for him, per se. And almost immediately, the changes were evident. Uh, he started asking when he could come more. He actually wants to volunteer, as, and he's you know, 12 years old, and he's looking for opportunities to volunteer. He talks about his horse at home. Um, he just, again though, the, the confidence that I've seen with JT, and, and he has grown so much already through this process. Um, he's even talking about a future. His career, his career goals have changed. This has been a life changer and game changer for my family, and as parents, we wanna do anything we can to help our kids and this has absolutely been a, a wonderful opportunity and I'm so thankful for it. Several years ago, a patient came to me after witnessing a murder-suicide where she was in jeopardy. When she came to the therapeutic setting, she was very shut down and did not want to do the work she needed to do to get her life to move forward. I had heard about New Day and I referred her here. Then I quickly panicked and wondered why I would send a patient to a program I didn't know enough about. So when I came and visited New Day, I realized all the good things that could happen for my patients here with these horses. Since that day, 
Not only that patient, but many patients that have come here have seen remarkable changes that I would not normally see in the office for months or even years, if ever. Well, I chose Chip because I like, I mean, yeah, there's some easy horses here, but I heard Chip was a younger and My therapy here at New Day is like more productive, in my opinion, because in your office, I mean, yeah, it is helpful because we talk about it, but here we actually do it. Well, Chip actually like listened to my commands when there's this one activity where you, you walk around in the circle and you leave him there. I don't know the exact name of it, but he like, even when I was behind him, he trusted me. He listened to my commands and his eyes like and his body movements showed me that he was like calm when I was rushing or whatever. It's really helpful and like boosts my self-esteem a lot, knowing that like something or someone, or I guess, trusts me in a way. Well, it's helped me become more patient and calm for like what I'm doing. And like, for, I have a brother and it helps me stay more calm to get to my nerves or whatever. Chip and I are like both stubborn, we're both pretty young. We don't do things that we don't want to do, usually. We're, very sh we're also very shy and like around new people or whatever. Um, I think like our similar, or our personalities interact and, and we're like very similar and I think it's just that goes well together in any friendship or whatever. like to come alongside people of all ages to help them overcome life's challenges. It could be anywhere from um, uh, balancing your life issues, stress management, overcoming anxiety, having difficulty in a relationship, having difficulty with their peers or um, fellow students. I was blessed with the gift of a horse and what I didn't realize is that I was out of balance. The horse Gallatin Kid helped me get back into balance. I said, oh my gosh, I want to share this with anybody and everybody I can. And so I absolutely took a leap of faith and began New Day Ranch. I see nothing but pos positive um, actions, people volunteering, working. Our family has absolutely grown. And outside of our, our immediate family, we just feel like we've inherited several dozens of new family members. Beth, Rebecca, Jean, and all the volunteers, they are a family. We have a five bedroom home that we're sharing with New Day for their retreats and their get togethers, conferences, uh, overnight stays. It's a beautiful home that they, they can come in and relax and just get away from things. It's, it's very hard to explain. It, it is like something much higher uh, than Deb and I um, it is really in control of everything that's going on here at the farm. Um, just, it's, it's just a real blessing to see all the positive, the helping of the children and any special need. Um, it's just been a real blessing. I think that Brenna and I were actually some of the first participants in the New Day Equine Therapy Program, and it has been an absolutely wonderful experience. We've been here for about, what, three or four months now, Brenna? That sounds correct. My favorite part is getting to spend with my favorite horse, Porter. It really helps me calm down, and it really helps my anxiety, and it helps me get to spend time with the animal I love. So the equine therapy has been phenomenal for Brenna. She works with a certified instructor, Judy Williams, who has absolutely been a godsend to us. And Judy has been working with Brenna on techniques to help reduce her anxiety in various situations, and also to help her learn some flexibility in otherwise inflexible life situations. The equine therapy has helped Brenna be able to utilize different techniques in the real world to help her relax, help her respond in a more flexible manner to otherwise inflexible situations. It's really facilitated in a lot of growth that I've seen with her in the last few months. 
Brenna has always had a very strong love of horses and a strong bond with horses. And when we were looking to try to come up with some treatment modalities for her anxiety, her therapist had talked to us about PATH certified instructors and how that would help her with learning some coping mechanisms. New Day could be used either on an individual basis for kids with all sorts of anxiety disorders, um, for explosive children with inflexibility, but also I think that traditional therapy and the equine therapy complement each other to help these kids get on track. And a lot of times we'll discuss Brenna's therapy here with her traditional therapist and it really helps to solidify some of the techniques. The changes that I see in people every day um, are just this side of being a miracle. What we like to do is use uh, the language that the horse communicates with. They communicate through body language. Because of the herd dynamics and the requirements that they demand a relationship, it simulates having a family in all of our complex relationships. So by studying and understanding the relationships of the horse and how they're appropriately communicating with each other, we then translate that into appropriate communication for each other. Horses don't know how to tell a lie. They don't know how to mask their feelings. They are true and honest, and, but they also are very loving and caring and sensitive. And we use that natural relationship as a mirror to help other people overcome their relationship challenges. When Echo first got described to me, um, they said, well, he has problems with being touched and problems with being brushed. He might not, he might not seem friendly. And I, I thought that, that was OK because I'm sort of the same way. They described him as having some sort of sensory issue, and I thought, I, ha I'm, I have the same thing. Yeah, I really like doing therapy here because um, when I do it here, I feel like there's less pressure to have to talk about um, have to talk about problems that I have in my life specifically. I feel like here I can just talk about what I feel and I don't know. I don't get to experience the outdoors a lot. I live in a city, so. Uh, I get to experience that and I get to, of course I, I like being with Echo because I really, I really can connect with them. But I can say that he just makes me really happy and I, you know, I always remember that I have Echo here and that I'm, you know, I'm his special human. Well, being in therapy with, with people is just really different from being here with Echo because when I'm around people there's a lot of social pressure and I feel like I have to make eye contact and I feel like sometimes the things I say won't make sense when they come out of my mouth but when I'm with Echo he seems like he understands everything I'm saying and I don't have to make eye contact with him and of course he doesn't really judge me. I never judged him and he repays the favor. Uh, New Day Ranch is a 501c3 nonprofit. We make it work with the many hours, the many demands of caring for 10 horses requires um, through the love kindness, generosity of not only committed volunteers, but we rely heavily on donations. It costs about $360 a day for a horse. Without the generosity of our sponsors, this program would not exist, and we are so, so grateful. I get great joy coming to the farm and just seeing people here relaxing, enjoying, 
having a sense of somewhere to belong. To sponsor or volunteer with this organization would be something that would provide an absolutely invaluable experience, no question. Uh, the kids who could benefit from this vary greatly. There's so many different opportunities for, for children of all ages and all ability levels and, and so many different experiences and backgrounds. I, I feel like this could help anyone. It's amazing to see how some of these children just thrive and grow through their experiences here. New Day is a special place of healing. And for individuals who feel that sitting in a counselor setting, having that human to human connection is too frightening and they are too riddled with shame or humiliation to sit in an office setting to talk to another human being about their innermost thoughts. New Day is a wonderful, beautiful healing experience for them to begin the process of counseling. Hi, this is Rebecca Trout and I'm a volunteer here at New Day at Meadowview Farms. Wanted to just tell you a little bit about why I volunteer. I've been working with Beth for over six years and once you start to understand how these horses communicate with the people of special needs, you can't help but volunteer. If you understood the meaning behind these horses and the language that they speak to the people that come here, you'd want to be here too. We really appreciate all of our volunteers and all of our sponsors, and we can't do this without you. Please join us in our mission.